It was an emotional day for those at the prison today. Among them, two works for you reporter Will Dupree. He was chosen to be one of the few witnesses to Glossop's execution, and he continues our coverage tonight with reaction from McAllister. We love you! Outside the state penitentiary in McAllister, supporters got a phone call from a confused Richard Glossop who wondered why his execution didn't go as planned. Instead of potassium chloride, they get potassium acetate, which is a food preservative. Supporters are obviously relieved. They say Glossop's been on an emotional roller coaster, something they say is inhumane. If you want any more signs that this thing is broken and left in the hands of fallible human beings, here it is right here. During the past week, Glossop's legal team filed a flurry of requests and appeals to stop the execution, but nothing worked. Glossop's attorneys and friends stand by his claim of innocence. He is not guilty. You know, justice will not be served if he is killed. From McAllister, Will Dupree, two works for you.